So when people talk about the iconography of the Earthbound series, they generally talk about its suburban setting, particularly in relation to Earthbound. But uh, it's, you know, suburban setting, uh, everyday America, and, uh, you know, other sorts of takes on countries. And I agree that that's very much a prominent, you know, visual cue for we're looking at the Earthbound series. But uh, a piece of uh, Earthbound iconography that I really love is the Franklin Badge. Uh, I even made it recently. Uh, I made one for my girlfriend at, at a Perler Beads. Uh, this is actually based on the sprite from Mother 3, which took me forever to track down, by the way. And uh, I just wanted to spend a little bit of time talking about uh, the Franklin Badge, because uh, I there's some things about it that I think are interesting, and uh, I think it would be interesting to relay on to you. So, if you played Earthbound Beginnings, you'll know that it's called the Franklin Badge because it's actually supposed to be a badge that Benjamin Franklin wore when he was doing his electricity experiments, conducting them, if you will. And uh, it's the only game that actually expounds on this lore because Mother 2 and Mother 3 both do not do not acknowledge this. And, uh, you know, I guess it's kind of to contribute to that whole American setting, American ideals uh, that the game is about. So, uh, you know, it's it's just this urban legend that he wore a badge, and I I think, you know, that's a, that's just a cool piece of lore, and you know, I'm, I, you know, Earthbound Begins is already so different from the other two games in the series already, that it's like, okay, you know what, it can have this piece of lore that can or cannot be canon, because the toy's been kind of vague on if, uh, if Mother 2 is really all that connected to Mother 1 outside of Gygus, etc, etc, but the, the canon lore is Benjamin Franklin wore this. This is what the badge looked like in the instruction manual for Mother. Now imagine, if you will, Benjamin Franklin wearing this badge. I, I think it's hilarious that it's just a smiley face button. I think that's so funny. And uh, I don't know if this was his vision for it, because that is hilarious. If if, you know, obviously in American artwork for it, it's a lot more basic and a lot less interesting. But I, I love the smiling face. I think that's so funny. Even though I, I really love the design of the Franklin badge we have now, which, while we're on this topic, I don't get why it says Mother. It has the Mother logo on it. I understand it's from the Mother series, and I understand why it would be on merchandise, okay? But why is it on- why is it on the badge in Super Smash Brothers? Like, there's a trophy for the Franklin badge that explains what it is. So are you telling me canonically in Mother 2 and Mother 3 it says Mother on it? <laughs> what does that mean? The, the lore is so deep on this one, and honestly I'm not huge on that. I don't get it. It's the only piece of- it's the only, like, item in the Smash series that kind of does this, and I don't understand why it does. I think it looks, I think, in-game at least, I think it looks kind of stupid, but, you know, again, reiterating that on merchandise, I understand why they would have it. The Hobonichi Mother Project kind of did that as well, and uh, I think they just kind of adopted this as the, you know, final official look for the Franklin Badge, and it doesn't bother me all that much, but I just don't really understand it story-wise. Also, um, it's interesting that there are several Franklin badges to exist, implying that Benjamin Franklin wore several of these uh, smiley face badges, which is hilarious. But uh, I think that's why it's feasible that Flint has one in Mother 3. I, 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 and I understand it's the root of all of this. Is Flint actually Ness? Is he Ness from another dimension? No, he's not. There's just several of these that exist, and it's a courage badge. He had it since he was a kid, and look, you know, who knows how long Mother 3 takes place after Earthbound, and who knows if it's even in the same dimension, because there's some sort of, there's some theories that it's like, oh, this is actually just another world. And, uh, you know, it, you know, I don't subscribe to one idea particularly over the other, there's, there's evidence to support both, but... I think it's very feasible that, you know, if there's this Im implication that there are several Franklin badges, it's very much possible Flint has his own uh, and was able to get it and he is not Ness. Besides, Ness is this guy. Anyways, he gives it to you in the form of the Courage badge and it doesn't do anything. I don't know why. Uh, I, I don't, I guess it's just, I, I don't understand why the Mr. Saturn polishing it all of a sudden makes it reflect. I guess it's just that specific material and it's not a magical property. Again, lore so deep. Anyways, I just want to take a few minutes to talk about the 
uh, Franklin badge because I think it's an interesting piece of Earthbound uh, of Earthbound aesthetics, and uh, I think certain elements of it dis uh, deserve to be more discussed than they are. Which which badge <laughs> design do you like better?